Lord, welcome back to the channel. I thought I'd do a quick unboxing of this mic that I have bought for my PC, the Tono TC30. Thinking that I will be definitely doing some uh, voiceovers uh, on some of the videos, so I'll probably need to get a mic for my PC and not rely on the uh, humble little Microsoft uh, webcam uh, mic that I have. And um, and you perhaps use the uh, GoPro uh, as the webcam as well to record some good footage on that. So I decided to purchase this uh, Tono TC30. There seems to be quite a few uh, people out there uh, using it, and it's for about 40 pounds. And so we'll go ahead and let's unbox it. Right, so here's the box. Uh, see what we get inside. Okay, we're getting a little instruction booklet, which seems to be quite detailed. That's for Mac and Windows, I think, from the look of it, or is it just Mac? Not sure. So that is that. Here is the mic itself. And little tripod on it. Interesting. And it's actually mounted in some rubber bands in there, so it's absorbed all sorts of shocks. Okay, so that is that. Put it down here for a moment. You can also get a pop filter. Which is quite nice. And then the USB cable. And I think put this aside here for a bit. But that is it in the box. Yeah. Put that aside. Let's have a closer look. So that can be adjusted. the pop filter goes on the top here and I believe this should be able to slide back a bit so that it's not resting against the pop filter this free floating and the cable and that is it so pretty straightforward what we get Get a closer look. Seems all nice solidly made. That's metal. The stand seems to be metal. I believe the stand is unscrewable. Yeah. So it will come off. So you can put the mic on, a, on an arm or a boom or something. We shall give it a test and see how it performs. Okay, let's see what it takes to plug this microphone into Windows uh, 10 that I have here. But before we do that, I just want to do a test on the volume and the uh, quality of this current uh, webcam that I have, which is just a straightforward Microsoft HD from probably 10 years ago. So I'll say a few things and we'll test it on the other mic just to compare and see what it's like. So uh, testing, testing, one, two, three, testing, testing, one, two, three. Let's compare that when we plug the mic in. Okay, I'm going to plug it in and let's see what Windows makes of it. I'm hoping Windows 10 should just recognize it and uh, we have a, the mic there. Let's give it a few seconds, let's see if anything pops up. So apparently nothing should pop up. It is recognized straight away. If I can look at my sounds from my system tray, the auto recording, there it is. 
that Tonner TC30 already recognized and installed immediately. I was expecting some pop-up or some setup uh, uh, to come through. Uh, and even in the Camtasia recorder here, under the audio button, when I'm not recording, it, it's in the drop list there. So what I will do now is I will stop the recording, switch to the tono mic, and then we'll do the test again and just see what it sounds like, if it sounds any different. So we've now switched the mic to the Tonor TC30, and uh, I don't know if we can tell the difference at this point. I can't until I play back, and we'll see then. But I'll repeat the test, and uh, I'll try and put them close to each other and repeat the two tests just to see if there is any actually any difference between the mic, which is right here, probably about 40 centimeters from uh, my face, and pointing directly uh, at me. So here we go. Testing one, two, three. Testing, one, two, three. So, uh, testing, testing, one, two, three. Testing, testing, one, two, three. So I think there definitely was a difference between the two uh, mic recordings. The old Microsoft one, a bit more tinny, a bit more hissy. Uh, while the, uh, the Tonor TC30 seems to be uh, a lot more uh, rounded, smoother, uh, not as... Uh, as, t as tinny, that one. And I've just made another discovery. I've got lights in the camera, in, in the mic. Didn't realize I bought one with that. But anyway, so this is probably a nice little useful addition to my little setup going forward. Uh, so when I'm doing uh, any voiceovers in the future, I can at least get the, the audio uh, a bit better than the uh, built-in little tinny mic and the old barreled um, Microsoft uh, webcam from 10 odd years ago. So I look forward to using this some more. Well, I hope that was useful to you. And uh, please uh, do subscribe uh, and uh, tinkle that bell. And uh, so that when I do post another video, which will be as and when, and uh, that you will get a, an alert on that and uh, hopefully you will follow my journey as I'm going forward with this whole motto vlogging uh, year for in 2023. One of my New Year's resolutions to get out there, get, get out some more on the bike. And uh, so I hope you'll join me on that journey. Bye bye for now.